We're back in Bangkok. And everything is super easy already. We bypassed every single line thanks to the kids. And everybody was super nice. And the kids already got a handful of candy. <laughs> oh, Dad, did you see in our, our line bypass service? Uh, we charge you. Oh, boy. You guys got to make all lives easier. I'd love to hear how you make my life easier. Uh, let's see. Since we, you had us, we got to cut the line. Uh, every line. What about all the extra tickets I need to buy for you? Yeah, that's your fault. We're just outside Royal Pizza, the kids' favorite pizza place. Picking up some za. I know it's not very Thai, but we figured the kids had a long day. When we arrived, their room wasn't ready, so we had to take them on the train, and we went to the mall just to kind of hang out in some AC. So it was a bit of a long day for them. So we are gonna treat them to some pizza, but then tomorrow it's markets all the time. So low-key evening tonight. Hit the bed early. We woke up pretty early to catch our flights. And then tomorrow is another day in Bangkok. Are you excited? Happy to be back? <laughs> My fave. Just smiles everywhere. Everyone made life easy as we arrived. And, you know, it's just got a different feel here. It just feels kind of homey. You can see the smiles through their masks. <laughs> You're being too loud. Wait, line up fast. Guys, guys, come on. Wait, How's school going, Jess? Dad, we're gonna like, line up. What kind of teacher are you? Uh, Anna? Yeah? Did you learn anything today in school? I should. Oh my god. You're such a master clean. How's school today? I'm trying to be mad. I'm trying to stay mad. Christmas. <laughs> we gotta get him in a room. Mommy, can we take a picture? So we're back in Bangkok. Yesterday we took it easy, some pizza for dinner. But tonight we're back on the street. I got my delicious chicken wings for my favorite guy. Jessica's getting some green curry. Kids are getting some smoothies and a couple of pork skins. Life is good again. You guys happy to be back in Thailand? <laughs> what is this? Hannah, how's your meat stick? Is it yummy? See, uh, I got a different one than you. What'd I got you, this one. What'd you get, Everett? Uh, I have like a chicken and like whatever Hannah. A chicken and a pork? Mm -hmm. Not bad. Not bad? <laughs> Why, you eat that one, Hannah. It's okay, sweetie. You eat it. Oh, I can taste it? Do you not like it? Oh, yummy. You're eating two at one time. Try and finish one. This is delicious. What kind of it? Orange. It's like tangerine. It tastes like pure tangerine. It's so yummy. What do you got there? Mango. Is Thai mango the best mango? <laughs> Daddy, do we have mango back at Canada? Thai mango. Thai mango. Thai mango. Thai mango. See, this is the whole problem. You can't have an intelligent conversation with this guy. Typical Thai fashion. We bought two rotis with condensed milk. And the man saw we had three kids and made one for Hannah just to be nice. The people in Thailand are definitely the nicest people that we've met on this trip so far. We didn't make that one. Too full. On to the next.
So just got off the BTS line. Huge anime convention. The kids are so excited. So that was cool. Kids like seeing those characters. There's a million people out there. I thought that was just like a convention outside, but in the mall, it's just full of people and characters. It's so funny to see like somebody's looking for a purse dressed up as some character. So now we're going to drop these kids off at a play center that's in this mall. What's it called? Play Mondo. So we're gonna drop them off at Play Mondo, and then me and Jess are gonna go have a coffee without our children. Yeah, we're gonna get food too. We're gonna get food too. Okay, so we're outside of Play Mondo. The kids are in there having a blast already. And right outside of Play Mondo in this mall, it's an ice skating rink. It's not that cold in here, so the ice is pretty watery. And there's a lot of people falling and getting pretty wet. But I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed with the with Thai people. As Canadian, as soon as you start walking, it's time to start skating. I couldn't imagine not knowing how to skate and having to learn how to skate on a pretty wet surface because you do spend a lot of time on your butt. But everyone's doing pretty great. It's also really funny to see people skating in like t-shirts because whenever we're skating and everyone's always bundled up or wearing hockey equipment. So it's so funny to see like there's a woman wearing a sundress skating around, it's so funny. I gotta say, I'm impressed. It is called Japan Expo. Bands performing, martial art, different food stalls. Really cool. Uh, the food stalls were packed, so I didn't end up getting any food from there. We went to the grocery store, and it was the best, nicest grocery store I've ever been in. Check this out, look at this. Oh, focus. Jessica just asked, do you want me to record you? We've tried this in the past. You probably noticed when Jessica was filming, it looked like this. Hey, this, like this, or it looks like this. Hey guys, all right, you're gonna have those delicious snacks while the kids are here so I can eat the whole thing to myself. And kids, if you're watching this, me and your mom just had delicious juice and delicious treats without you. <laughs> I get a lot of that. <laughs> I can hear it all going, hey. Uh. Oh, the kids are coming. Hide it, hide it. <laughs> Quick pee break before we jump back on the train. This mall is incredible. This mall has absolutely everything. It's got seven or eight floors. Two floors just for restaurants, like unreal restaurants. Japan Expo is amazing. There's like 15 stages everywhere you look with different music, different like shows. Came here to take the kids to play Mondo, ended up staying the whole day. Thailand never disappoints. <laughs> 